full marks for both the things. Then what was the first formula? 3y equal to 2x, is it? Another one? 5y plus? Yeah? 200? Right. Now see how I'm going to do this scalar. Okay. This first, this second. I'm going to get a third one. It means here, if they give anything equal like this, 3y equal to 2x scale if they give, remember, you can make anything equal. It means make a letter alone and send all the things to other side. So I'm going to make y alone. And I'm going to send this 3 to other side. If I make y alone, y is equal to what you get here. Here 2x, no? 2x, send the 3 to this side become, divide by 3. So you get y is, y is equal to 2x over 3. It means you're making a letter alone and sending this to other side. Okay? Then after that, instead of this y, you are going to put this. Okay, you're going to substitute. So I'm going to write like this, sub three to two. Okay, you're going to substitute third one to second one. Okay, it means this one you're going to put for this. So what is here? Whatever in this formula I'll write like this, 5 plus 3x is equal to 266. So I'm going to insert, instead of this y, I'm going to insert this part. So what is that? Into 2x over 3. Okay? Because y is equal to 2x over 3. No? So I'm going to insert this 2x over 3 here. Directly. So you can see, can we cut anything here? Can't cut, no. So what I'm going to do, there is a denominator balance book. You are getting a denominator. What is the denominator here? This denominator is 3. Sometime in case if you get a simplification one, no need to do this. You will say this 3 you can cut from this mean. No need to do this part. If it's not simplifiable one, you can do this part. What? This denominator is 3. So what should you do, my dear? Multiply everything by 3. This denominator is 3. No? Therefore, multiply everything by 3. This by 3, this by 3, and this by 3. And when you do this, what will happen? Why we multiply by 3? What's my purpose? Because to cut this denominator. That was my purpose. Because there is a denominator 3, so I multiply every term by 3. Then, my dear, what I'm going to do now? 5 into 2x become how much? 10x. 3x into 3 become 9x. Equal to 3 into 6 become? Again, this is 798. So 10x and... Uh, 9x how much? 19x is equal to 798. So x is equal to 798 divided by 19. x is equal to how much? 42. So I can use the first formula again. First, I can use directly the second formula here, third formula, sub 3 here. y equals 2x over 3. So I can use y is equal. I can use uh, 2 here. X means 42 divided by 3. Directly I can use y is equal to 20. Which one is easy? Which one is easy? Which one is uh, easy? The people uh, who can't think, who can't adapt the brain for a new condition, those people will say, like, right, you know, they won't change their what believes they will say